Alright, so today we are going to be playing a little bit more of a popular game on Roblox called Aimblox Beta. And if you don't know what Aimblox is, I'm pretty sure Aimblox is like a thing where like you can go train your aim and all that stuff. But they actually made a Roblox game for whatever odd reason and we're going to go ahead and play it. Now we're just going to go into the quick play because I'm pretty sure the quick play is just a bunch of random game modes. And it'll give us the best experience possible. Alright, so here we are in game, finally. And this game is its kind of an interesting game. What did I just do? What did I just do? How? But this game reminds me of a very, very certain game that I think everybody knows on Roblox and loves or hates. I don't want to say it, but I'm going to say it. This game is kind of like Arsenal. Like a lot of similarities from Arsenal. But obviously, you know, it's Aimblocks' spin. So Aimblocks is really all about just, you know, practicing your headshots and just practicing your aim for FPS games in general. You'll see at the end of the game that there's going to be a little thingy that tells you how accurate you were for the entire game and you can go ahead and cry because you have 0% accuracy. Now the one thing that is kind of weird about this game is that it has ADSing but like I really don't think ADSing is that useful in this game. Now I say that because the bodies are so big and the hitboxes are so big I just don't I really don't see a point. But one thing I do really like about this game is the movement. Now, you guys know I'm all crazy for the movement. Always. Every game. If you got good movement, I love this game instantly. And this game is quite literally fast-paced, in your face, slide around, spawn kill, go stupid, go crazy, go stupid. Now, I've always been a big fan of the movement shooters. I don't know why. It's just I feel like the, the skill cap is way higher for movement shooters because you're always moving around. And you're always trying to, you know, hit your headshots and all that stuff. Uh, what is this gun? What is this gun? Right now, I think we're playing a gun game. I'm not too sure. I didn't really pay attention to what we were selecting to, but I'm pretty sure this is gun game. Okay. Okay. What are you aiming at? What are you- What? I don't ever want to talk about that ever again. But the graphics and the guns are really well made. I really do like it. It's just, I, 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 the only thing that's really holding this game back is the fact that it's like Arsenal and I just won the game really easily. Wow, okay, well that was, that was kind of easy. Look at me go, yeah, baller, baller. And as you see, it tells you your accuracy breakdown. You, I missed apparently 68% of my shots. That's unrealistic. I hit 100% of the shots I take. Even the select team is exactly like Arsenal. Like, I can't help but think that this game kind of just looked at Arsenal and was like, yo, copy my homework, but don't make it obvious. And then they did this. This game does focus more on like the graphics and the individual guns rather than just like a bunch of weird stuff like spells or whatever they have in Arsenal. Ah, 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 ah. I'm on a roll right now. Literally like 90% of people on Roblox can't aim. So if you just out movement them, it literally is just the easiest thing in the world. Gee, I, did he just punch me? Another thing that I have a problem with this game is the sound design. Now, I know that some of the sounds are from taken from other games. Like I know the AK sounds from Counter-Strike, but I can't help but think these guns just feel weak. You know, like I feel like a gun should be like powerful. It should be loud, but this feels like I'm shooting a pea shooter. Oh, and I won again. I'm literally just crazy. What? I'm not in first place? Okay. All right, so this game mode is Space Snipers, and it's exactly as it sounds. It is quite literally snipers, but you are in space. And another cool thing about Aimblocks is that they do host tournaments too. I knew Ruby came in second place in one of these tournaments and won $8,000. So like, you know, Aimblocks, you ever hosting an event, please invite me. Crossbow. I missed, missed again, missed again, missed five minutes later, missed again, stop missing, oh my god, 65, I'm just saying, if we're, if we're using snipers only, I feel like they should, they, they should one shot, you know what I'm saying, especially if they're slow, psych, like how is that not a headshot, also, I noticed, I have pink team, now, I know, in, I know in Arsenal, pink teams is like some kind of like meme or whatever. It's like some secret team. Is it because I'm a star creator, I have this special team that nobody else has? Somebody who plays aim blocks, let me know in the comments because I'm actually kind of confused. I just realized that I'm on nobody's team. But I think that's where I'm going to end today's video. If you guys enjoyed this, let me know in the comments and let me know what I should play next because I really like to play something new. Anyways, guys, I hope to see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.